five set battle, heck of a game inside the saw tonight. Their initial reactions to the season ending loss. Um, I already ha had my reactions with, with the team. Um, I'm really proud of our, our group and uh, proud of the way we battled. And um, we're all really sad and disappointed that we lost. Um, and um, just grateful to have been part of such an amazing match with a heck of a crowd. Um, you know, for sure one of the most exciting matches I think that's, that's been played in that gym. And um, yeah, pride is really the, the reaction uh, for my team, for my players, for our program for this college to be able to put on an event like this and then um, you know, have our, our women honor that, um, that effort that um, our staff put forth. Um, it just, just fills me with pride and um, doesn't take away from the pain, but um, um, we gave all we got. I mean, I saw a lot of grit and hard work from our team, um, a lot of fight, and just girls that did not want this to be our last game. So, Ira, back and forth up there, you did a great job in your front row tonight, really going at Northwestern. So, what was Northwestern's <coughs> biggest challenge that they presented to you? Well, I mean, I think all, all aspects of their game was just really on it today. Um, their swings were good, they set up a solid block, and their defense was outstanding. So I think we were just kind of, let's just go for it. And they were also in that same boat, so they got the best of us. And Caitlin, you were fantastic as a server tonight. So what exactly was Coach drawing up and you doing out there in that serving role tonight? I just go out there and give all I can for my team to be aggressive and try to get the other team out of system. That's really all I can do is just disrupt. So coach, now as the 2023 season comes to a close, obviously you gave some initial reactions a moment ago, but speak about how special this group is. Hosting a regional, advancing to the round of 32 for just the second time in program history. Yeah. What exactly does this group mean to you? Well, we did a bunch of things that um, really were, were program first. Um, we spent more more weeks in the top 25 than we ever had before. We attained our highest regional ranking ever. You know, certainly um, we've never done this before. Um, and, um, you know, these press conferences suck after you lose. Um, but I gotta tell you, it feels a little bit better doing it here um, in, our, in our building with our people. Um, so, um, yeah, I mean, all, all those things. Winning a, winning a home match in the NCAA double, double tournament, obviously we've never done that. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I, I can't talk about all the other stuff because um, because it's that meaningful and important. And we got a great team, wonderful women who love each other. And um, you saw that on the court. And we've been talking about that all week that, um, uh, you know, that, that gave us the boost. I mean, that's why we almost beat the fifth ranked team in the country is because of that love that uh, they share um, certainly the love that we felt from everybody here at Cornell and um, you know, we've talked a lot about that this, this weekend and, um, and I'm really proud of them for, um, again, for honoring that and going out and playing the way we did. So for you three as players, as seniors, obviously Grace, you as a fifth year, it was a special week this year. So many wonderful memories made along the way. So what are your lasting memories going to be? Um, well, I think I'll just 
take away all the love that I received and gave this season. Um, this was like the best group of girls that I could ever imagine being with and so grateful that this was how my senior season ended with them. Yeah. I'm not going to talk because I'm going to start bawling my eyes out. <laughs> just all the love and yeah, I don't know. Yeah. There's just so much support and everybody cares about each other so much and all my kids are like my sisters. We grew such close bonds and there's just, like they said, like so much love. Thank you for, for your time and congratulations on a special season. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Jumpin' Jack.